I'm also being joined by my colleague Dharani. Thank you, Dharani. Good evening, Dharani. Um, you know, Sadhguru has a huge following. Um, how is this really being looked at in Tamil Nadu where uh, his ashram is? Not only by the Isha Foundation, but also how is the police now responding to this? How is the police reacting to this considering the Supreme Court has taken a very strong objection to how a team of almost 150 police personnel had entered the ashram? The main ashram of uh, you know uh, Isha Yoga is located in Coimbatore district of Tamil Nadu, and as you rightly said, uh, over 150 police personnel they were involved in searches at the uh, premises of uh, Isha Yoga Foundation. But uh, following the Supreme Court uh, you know uh, direction, now the police they are refraining from uh, taking any further action or making any further step uh, in this case. In fact, on September 30, uh, the Madras High Court had directed the Tamil Nadu Police Department uh, to uh, submit a detailed uh, report, uh, you know, furnish all the details. Uh, about uh, the criminal cases registered against Isha Foundation, all the criminal cases, and uh, you know now the Supreme Court has uh, told that this uh, report should be should be submitted to them and not to the Madras High Court. And the Supreme Court has also transferred the case uh, from the Madras High Court to itself. Uh, the Isha Foundation has welcomed uh, this intervention of the Supreme Court, but uh, uh, since the matter is sub uh, they do not want to comment any further on this matter. Is what they have told. But as far as uh, uh, followers followers of Isha are concerned, uh, of course they are uh, keeping a close track of for the developments from the Supreme Court and earlier also uh, they were uh, keeping a close at, uh, watch on the development from the Madras High Court. Uh, we have to wait and see how this, this is going to pan out legally. Uh, the uh the case has been adjourned to October 18, but for the time being, uh, it is business as usual in Isha Foundation and the Tamil Nadu police, they will not be uh, doing any more searches and they will not be uh, initiating any kind of action against uh, Isha Foundation since uh, the Supreme Court has uh, refrained them from uh, doing so. Uh, so we have to wait and see how the matter is going to pan out legally in the upcoming days in the Supreme Court. Right. Dharani, thank you very much for joining us with those details.